This is factorize. 2x is part 3 minus 9x is part 2 plus 3x plus 4. Now, completely. But we are given options in... We are given option in factor. We are not given in root. If you have... Let me say you have your answer to be x to be equal to 2, x to be equal to 5. Now, this is root. If you want to convert this root to factor, you now take it inside. So, you have... This root becomes a factor of x minus 2. So, equals 0. If you take this one inside, it becomes x minus 5 equals 0. So, this is root. This is root. And these are what are factors. So, but if you see the question, we are given every answer in factor, not in root. So, let's say, for instance, you have your final answer to be x is equal to 7, x to be equal to minus 5, x to be equals to 8. Now, if you want to convert this, these are roots. We want to convert them to factor. For the first one here, to be x, if you take this one inside, it is positive before, it becomes what? Minus. So, we now have it to be x minus 7 equals 0. This one is my, my, uh, negative before. If you take it inside, it becomes plus. So, it is x plus 5 equals 0. This one is positive before. If you take it inside, it becomes x minus 8 x minus 8 equals 0. So that is how to convert from root to what? To factor. Now, let us solve this question. Let us find the root first. Now, how do we find the root? So let's press on the calculator. Press your mode. Press your equation. Now, you see that this one is, the highest power is 3. So we are going to go with the one with the highest power to be number 4. So press it. Now, let us press the coefficient. The coefficient for the first one is 2. So 2 equals 2. The next one is minus 9. So minus 9 equals 2. Next one is 3. So 3 equals 2. Next one is 4. So 4 equals 2. The press equals 2 again. You have the first answer. You can see that x1 is what? Is minus 1 over 2. x1 is minus 1 over 2. Press equals 2 again. We have x2 to be what? To be 4. Press equals 2 again. You have x3 to be equals to 1. Some people will ask me, how do we know the numbers of x we are going to get? The numbers of x is determined based on the highest power. So can you see that the highest power of this one is 3? So the number of x you must get must be 3. As mean you have quadratic now. Quadratic, the highest power of quadratic is 2. So the, that's why you always get two numbers for quadratic. So if the highest power of your equation is 4, you must get the, uh, the four numbers for the word, for the question. Now, let us convert this into factor. This is our root. We got root from the calculator. So, let us convert this to factor. We want to convert. So, the first one, x, if you take minus 1 over 2 inside, it will be x plus 1 over 2. This is the first one. If you take 4 inside, it becomes x minus 4. So, that's it. If you take 1 inside, it will be x minus 1. So, that's it. But you can you see, we have x minus 4, x minus 1. Which one then takes x minus 1? This 3 and takes x minus 1. We also have x minus 4. This one entails x minus 4. Okay. This one entails x minus 4. This one also entails x minus 4. But this one don't entails x minus 1. So this one is wrong. So the correct answer is what? Option C. You can see that option C has x minus 1, x minus 4. Even this one is for this one because as me you have x, x plus 1 over 2 to be equal to 0 now. Let's multiply all three by 2. If you multiply all three by 2, that will be 2x. Then 2 times, 2 times x will be 2x. 2 times 1 over 2 will give us 1. So everything equals 0. So the factor here is 2x plus 1, which is what? Option C. So the correct answer is what? Is option C. So thank you very much. Like, comment, and subscribe. I remain Inshallah David. Bless my name. Popularly known as General David. Follow us for more videos. Thank you. God bless you.